Ayo, hey, what's up with AMD's X3D tech? Is it really better than just like a regular CPU? You're talking about AMD's 3D vCache, right? It's a pretty big deal for gaming. Let's pour over the details. Cool, but what is 3D vCache anyway? Sounds like marketing. It's not just marketing. It's AMD's way of stacking extra L3 cache on the CPU vertically instead of spreading it out horizontally. It's like building another floor in a building instead of making the building wider. So why stack it up? Why not just make it wider like usual? So that's a good question. If you spread the cache outward, the CPU has to be bigger. That means the cores are farther from the cache, which slows things down. But if you stack it up, you can let the CPU be smaller and more compact, and that makes it faster while still adding the same amount of cache to it. All right, but what's L3 cache even used for? It's like the super fast storage for data the CPU needs often. It's shared by all the cores and it cuts down on trips to the slower system memory like RAM. That makes a huge difference for tasks like gaming. So they use it for speed and keeping all the parts really close together. Exactly, the extra cache speeds up gaming and other tasks where fast access to data is key and is especially useful in CPU heavy games. Got it, thanks Ayo, I'm always learning something here.